Hello and welcome to Akshu's Kitchen. Today we will see how to prepare laddu for which we will need the following ingredients to prepare approximately 20 to 25 medium sized laddus, 400 grams of sugar, 250 grams of gram flour, 8 to 9 whole green cardamom pods and 1 big pinch of saffron. First I am going to prepare the batter by adding some water to the gram flour and mixing it to a smooth batter or paste the amount of water you can detect by checking the batter by pouring it from the top using a spoon and if it forms clusters like this it needs more water so I am going to add little bit of more water to it and mix it again and check it once again by pouring it from the spoon though the batter has become smooth there are still some cluster formation so I am going to add little more water to it and mix it well again to a smooth paste and now finally my batter is smooth you can see the batter vanishes inside without forming any peaks or clusters so my batter is ready but still there are some lumps so to eradicate the lumps I am running the batter through a sieve so that I am getting a really creamy and smooth batter which we are going to use to prepare boondies to prepare boondies you need a slotted spoon like this to that spoon I am pouring some of the batter and you will get round boondies falling into the oil so use as much of batter you need to cover the oil and fry it until the bubbles settle down and you get crispy boondies once you take the boondies out of the oil allow the oil to reheat a little bit then only when you use the batter for the next time you will get round boondies if the oil is not hot enough then the boondies will flatten down now the bubbles are settled and the boondies are crispy uh, I am taking it out and draining in a tissue paper and continue this until all the batters are used up and keep the boondi ready and for the sugar syrup I am adding the sugar in a pan and I am removing the seeds from the cardamom pots and I am going to grind this cardamom seeds and saffron into a fine powder but when you add only this seeds and saffron you will not get a smooth powder so I am adding 2 tablespoons of sugar along with the seeds and saffron so that I will get a smooth powder this 2 tablespoon I am taking it from the 400 grams of sugar we are using and I am going to grind it into a fine powder and add it along with the remaining sugar and add about 1 cup of water to this sugar approximately 250 ml of water and heat it at medium flame allow the syrup to come to a boiling point like this I have added a little bit of yellow color to get the proper color for the laddu and now the sugar syrup is ready I am going to mix the boondies and the sugar syrup in a stand mixer you can also use a hand mixer or blender or mixer if you are using mixer or blender just turn it for one single round or else the boondies will get crushed up much I am allowing the boondies to soak in the sugar syrup for 2-3 to three minutes and then beating it at medium speed after 4 minutes the boondies have combined well it is in a good texture and condition to form laddus and our mixture is ready I am adding some cashew nuts and raisins to this mixture if you want to add these cashew nuts and raisins just add it in the final step don't add it along with the sugar syrup then your cashew nuts will get crushed up and you will not get whole cashew nuts and now we are in the final stage I am going to form laddus I am taking a little amount of laddu mixture in my hands and I am going to roll it out in my palms into round shape laddus and there we are laddu is ready complete the entire mixture by forming either small size or medium size laddus today I have prepared medium size laddus laddus are really great to taste thank you for watching Akshu's kitchen